Hello, and welcome back to another episode of No One Survived. You're hanging out with Miser, and this is episode 34 of our No One Survived series. Yes, I'm still alive. I wouldn't do that to you guys. Look at all the poop on the floor. See, this is why... <gasps> you bitch! How did you get out? What the heck? What did I build a fence for if you're just going to hop the sucker? Okay, so technically I built this fence to keep them in, even though they are not. Yeah, don't come walking over here like nothing happened. I saw you already. I didn't want to have to run around and hunt for poop because who would want to do that? So I did block these guys in here so that they can't get out. Um, I also blocked the chickens in so that my hens laid eggs in their little area. Listen to the little peeps. Isn't that adorable? I love that. Uh, the food bowls look good on both of those. You guys do your little animal-y things. That pig better be back in her little shed when I'm back. I swear. Um, there is a couple of things. Uh, we did get lots and lots of sun panels from the last POI that we did, which is right here. This bad boy. Lots and lots of these solar panels. We had three solar panels up here already, 300 per each. We got four 200s and 250s, which is honestly a lot better than I thought we were gonna do. I know I said I was done in here, but we're coming back to Poop Central so that I can put the food in here. Cause I grabbed some food off the bench. Okay, there we go. All right, we've got our lock picks. We've got a shit ton of ammunition. Now, what are we going to do with all of this ammunition? There are five total locations for bandit camps on this map. We've already been to two. Down here is one. We've been to this one over here near the plane crash. I think it's right over here by where I put my bed of doom, which is what I call the bed that I put when I think I'm going to die. Um, wow, there's a lot of beds on this map. Okay. Um, there's one right here where my mouse cursor is. I will put a giant red X, a little bit smaller red X on that spot. We've got one right over here, kind of centerish of map, uh, right in this area. And then we've got one final one right up here. And I would really like to get the final NPCs so that we can really begin our mass production of goods already let me show you this amazing amazing bountiful booty that these ladies have brought me mm, that sounds a little questionable look at these ladies bountiful booty look at all that stuff look at all the logs the logs alone make me log up man Jeez. okay so we're gonna head out i'm gonna Got my gun. I want to make a couple of items before I go. Right over here, we've got this handy dandy medical bench. I hardly ever go in here. Why? Because I am so good. I never need heels. Uh, don't call me on that because you all know I'm a liar. But this bench has virus blockers. It has penicillin. It has antibiotic healing patches. Hemostatic powder, which is made with rotten food questionable i'm questioning that we've got ointment we've got alcohol swabs which i love alcohol swabs i love the burn when you're hurt you know you're getting clean you know what i mean if it doesn't burn it's not clean in my opinion and then we got a regular bandage these don't look like the bandages and stuff that i'm used to and so i'm really interested in making some of these all i need is some medical herbs some fabric, which I've got a shit ton of fabric, and a little bit of rotten food. I've also got a fairly good supply of rotten food, just a little. So I'm going to make a couple of those to take with me. I've got my lockpicks to lockpick the doors to the cells. I've got my uh, oh shit gun, and I've got an oh shit amount of ammunition. So we'll take these. We're going to go out. We're going to kick some ass. Let's go. I couldn't figure out what the hell was blocking my lock picks, and so I moved it around a little bit and discovered that this is a bandage. And looking in the bandage box, 
I don't know what happened, but these are really pure bandages, I guess. I'm going to put this back in here. I don't like having things I can't see on me. I forget they're there. I think the, the regular old antibiotic healing patches and stuff are going to be better. Don't quote me on this, but I'm pretty sure that that is the bandit camp right up there. I'm going to hop out. We've got stuff in our bag so that we can go ahead and make a little... Did I just say bed? Well, shit. I've got stuff in the back of the car so that we can make a bed. That works, too. Just sleep in the back of the truck. Why can't we? That thing's huge. I want to sleep back there. Damn it, I'm going to sleep back there. Bet those bags would be super comfortable. Okay. Now, let's make the actual bed. There we go. Boop, right there. And then... No point in having the bed if you're not going to set it as your spawn point. There we go. All right. Oh, that was a huge save. All right. Let's put on our stabby and our shooty. I'm going to put everything else kind of in here. Just tuck it away. All right. You guys ready? Let's get our asses over here. Okay. I'm seeing a lot of blinking. I am seeing a little bit of movement right there. Yep. Okay, these guys respawn every five days. So once you kill them, they're usually pretty okay. He already he already knows I'm here. He knows I'm here if I could just find him. <laughs> Ouch! Oh, man. Okay. Oh, shit. Ah, shit, 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 shit. Who reloads their gun? Not me. Fuck reloading your gun. Why even bother? Can I... Can I please? Okay. Ooh, the kickback on this is insane. Okay, give me your weapons. Give me your bullets. Give me your ammo, your underwear. I want everything. This poor guy, does he not have a weapon? That guy does have a weapon. Okay. That is two, three, four, five down. Well, let's take a second and reload before we're dumbasses and run in with our stuff unloaded. Because look at the blood on the top of my head. I don't even want to know where that came from. I usually have quite a few guys in these places. So I'm wondering, normally I would hear them shooting by now or something. Puts me on edge. I don't like it. Okay, nothing there. Before I start looting, I am going to clear the area. Just because I'll get encumbered or something stupid and then wind up in a pickle. That's not good for anybody. Oh, here we go. Was it just five dudes? They didn't know I was coming. Otherwise, they would have been better prepared. Look at all that blood. Ooh. I think they were pretty well prepared. Maybe not, because like three of those dudes had... <gasps> Our first gentleman! <gasps> I'm so excited. Your name's Henry, I bet. Oop, that turns less. A little bit more. And done. Henry. Thank you. Oh, his voice is so deep. You're welcome. 
All right, let's go ahead and loot up. Hey, look at that iron mace. Impact 25, knockdown 25, damage 23. This one is so much better, but that knockdown, I bet, is pretty sweet. All right, let's do a little bit of looting really quick. I'm going to make quick work of this place. Batteries coming with. Uh, car repair kit will come with. I should repair this. I'm not going to just yet. No, you know what? Be a prepared miser. Don't be, don't be unprepared miser, okay? You guys saw what happened to her earlier. Switch these back around. I'll take it. I'm taking all of these. Do I need them? No, I do not. But I still want them, so I'm taking them. I'll take you guys as well. I'm already out of room. Oh, shit. And look at that. With the power of magic, I fit everything. I'm still very, very heavy, but you know what? It's fine. Just standing there, your arms behind your back, thinking that's going to make me. No, I got to go. Whoops. What am I trying to do? I'm trying to take off my bag so that I can actually walk. Because that was very cumbersome. Oh, my car is so far away. I'm going to actually bring that closer up. Well, shit. Oh. All right. So I went down and got my car. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Oops. Oh, don't fall on me. Ooh, his helmet is still spinning. I'm scared of that. Let's jump over this way. Okay, perfect. <laughs> I knocked his head off. Uh, where's the other body go? And they said let the bodies hit the floor. I don't... Oh. Oh, how unfortunate. But running people over with this big ass car is a lot of fun. Ah, there we go. Okay. Let's try to get out of that. Okay. There we go. Don't roll away. No, 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 no. Fuck my life. Oh my God. It's picking up speed. Shit. Oh, awesome. The tree stopped it. Thank goodness it was there. Oh, you guys don't get out of your car and just pray. Put the handbrake on. There is no handbrake on this, by the way. Oh no, is he caught underneath my vehicle? Oh, I guess I took too long and he despawned. That's, that's sad. That's really sad. Okay, so... Henry is already gone. He should be... Yeah, he's, he's out of there. He peaced out. Okay, so this is all looted. Let's take a little look right around here. Just, I already looked around this place. Those guys were not here. You guys saw that, right? I don't know why they suddenly spawned like that, but I do not appreciate it. Neither does my car. Can you imagine being a little car and being used to pile people down because they had the audacity to spawn after you left? Rude. All right, let's take a look here. A little camera jiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Do, 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 do. I could not. Okay. Oh my goodness. I'm leaving the invisible bandages. Ain't nobody got time for that. Okay, what about over here? Anything lootable? That is a solid no. What about you? Nope. Okay. There's not a lot of loot in this place, but we honestly came to get the NPCs, so I'm not mad about it. Let's see what else we got on this side. There are two, three more buildings over here to kind of take a look at. Take a look at the garbage can, which I missed going in. 
No, my my timer, my clothes are done. Miser's being a grown up and did laundry. Can you guys believe it? After being sick for two days, I was like, oh, I got to go to work tomorrow. And then it dawned on me that I didn't have any clean clothes. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, it's definitely a, I want my mommy moment. Nice, more ammunition. I really hope nothing else spawns because this would be a really, really bad time for things to come running at me. Oh, another industrial battery. That's awesome. Let's drop it on the floor as well as any books. Honestly, greenhouse, solar panels, good. Dow is fine. Honestly, I'm just taking this. Oh, no, I did the one thing you're not supposed to and hit escape. Hit this garbage can like the little trash pan as we are iron pick this is gonna go right in the dismantler which is me i'm the dismantler okay just gonna toss that up there so we can see it and i'm gonna take off my bag and empty it out i'll be right back Luckily, nothing else spawns, so I'm going to go ahead and grab that battery. Oh, it's too far down there. Whoopsies. We'll go around and pick it up. It's worth it. Just check here. Make sure nothing else is lootable. Lots of lootableness. Everything else looks good. I need to go get that laundry. I still have not gone and gotten it. I hate laundry. As an adult, there's nothing more insulting than having to go to work, slave all day, toil for another person, and then come home and have to clean the clothes you toiled in to go back and toil again. Seriously? Rude. It's just rude. Pretty much everything in here is packed up. I do not have any room to speak of, which is fine. We're going to go ahead and pop this bad boy back in here. I'm going to turn it on its side so we know that it has loot in it. Do I want to dump the rest of this stuff? Mm, 57. Yeah, I better. And then after this, we're going to go right to the next spot. Right on the other side of these trees, you can see... That there is another bandit camp. So let's make our way down over here. Try not to get shot up this time. Check our health. The water is looking a little bit. Oh, that has nothing in it. Okay. There we go. There, I see some movement. Can I... I put my gun away. Damn it. I saw some movement right in that area there. <gasps> Shit, that was not a smart idea. That wasn't the brightest idea. Now I just gotta wait for them to start trying to kill me. You know what? We don't wait for people to murder us. We murder people. Low-key, I wish it wasn't raining so hard, though. Since I saw the activity right over there, I want to come this way. Because it might be safer? I don't know. Can't see shit because of all these trees. Hopefully they have just as hard of a time seeing me. Okay. Alright. So we've gotten... Ow! 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 Ah, shit. Okay, I want to get the guy with the gun first. Okay. I'm shooting him right in his noggin. He should not be... Ooh. Yeah. Take it! Alright. Okay, I see some more sparks right down 
the line of sight there. Yeah, I think there's somebody else over there. I'm going to come this way with the really, really high hopes that I'll be able to see whatever's coming at me. Ah, run! Don't let them shoot you. Okay. Die. All right. Okay. So then we've got one more to go. Two more to go. Oh. If I'm shooting you in the face, you should definitely do more than just bow for a second. There he is. Oh, look at him standing right there. Oh, you simple, simple fool. Don't worry, I'll come in and help. Okay, I've got 78 bullets left. Okay, he's right on the other side of this. Ah, shit. Yeah, I win. Okay, anybody else? Down from there. Can't see shit because of all these little trees. Okay, reload again. I've still got 65 bullets in my gun, but you know what? I would rather be safe than dead. Ooh. Oh. You know, why am I trying to loot? There's no point. Alright, there's the cells. That's it. I could test and see if this really is it by running out and coming back in and seeing if anything respawns. But I'm going to go ahead and pick this shit and get this on the way. Okay, nothing, nothing. Ah, there's some movement. That was very quick. Another man. Angel. I wonder who they got to do the voice acting for these guys because it's a little weird. I could do better voice acting. Thank you. Thank you so much. Never mind. I take it back. I can't. All right. Uh, fire scent decoy. No. Viking axe I'll take. I don't know if I have that. We're just doing a really quick loot. Ooh, jean jacket. I will take that. Do I need it? No. I've got all the jackets I need. It is very cute, and I think it's going to look really good on my mannequin, so there you go. Oh, I'm going to just really quickly dip inside here, and I'm going to take this apart. It's taking up a lot of room, and it's really heavy, so we'll get that out of there. There we go. Let's pull out our gun just in case. I don't think there's going to be anybody left. I feel... Like I did a pretty thorough search, but you never know. Nothing over here. Nothing over here. Yeah, there's nothing up on top either. Okay, let's take a look in here. This is the big kahuna's house. Funny story, my my name in my phone is the Big Kahuna. <laughs> Why? I don't know. I don't even really remember. Oh, wow. I don't remember actually putting that as my name. It might have been something that I was showing my father or something like that. Because, you know, I'm bad with technology. He's even worse than me. But I'm Big Kahuna. So now whenever I'm like... Make a note to Big Kahuna. It comes to me. <laughs> there we go. And I'm going to go ahead and take the two knives. They're small. Compact is good. So go ahead and grab that. Ah, uh, refrigerator is good. That's going to be... 
Oh, nice. That's going to be our freezer, right? Yeah, I think it's the freezer. Uh, we already got a chainsaw and the metal bow. We're going to leave the rest of that stuff there. Okay, nothing else over there. Nothing over there. We already got the jailhouse. Let's take a look here. I'm going to just set this down. Mm, you know, I'm a little peckish. I could eat. I'm eating that, and it was so close to being bad. Oh, yep. That's beautiful. Love a good bit of dysentery. Really clears you out. Makes it so you're faster. I bet you guys didn't know that. Actually, I think animals do that, don't they? Like, if they're in danger, they just poop so they can get away faster. <laughs> Especially, I know snakes for sure do it. Like, if a snake is in danger... He will definitely shit and run away. Actually, maybe it's not shitting. Maybe maybe he just regurgitates his food so that he's not like weighed down. Maybe it's not shit. Maybe I've got some weird fascination with shit that I never thought about. <laughs> I talk about it way too much, honestly. The chickens, the... Oh, I don't even know. Why? my fascination with poop i'm curious i i took the gastric medicine but my dysentery is still persisting and whoa whoa it's not that serious i never noticed that before did they just put that in there because holy sh shiitake mushrooms it dysentery is not that serious Destroy safe zone table. No, that doesn't matter. Okay. I wish it gave me some type of countdown or some indication that my dysentery is going to go away. Because uh, that is, that makes me a little uncomfortable. I don't know if it really affects me too much, but I don't like it anyway. Okay, did that one... It did, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, I got the shortest memory in history. Look at that. That really makes these people a little bit more human. They play basketball. That makes me a little sad. These were people. How did I just only now realize it? Okay, I can't fit anything in here. I'm going to put everything on the ground here. That axe is going to be dismantled. <laughs> Bye. When I asked if it really did much, I was just watching my my energy just drain. Just gone. It literally like like it was liquid and somebody poked a hole in the bottom of the bag. It just it was gone. Okay. Just a little bit more. Yeah, why not? I do need gas. I'm going to pick up the fuel bottle and put it over here with this other stuff. Keep everything all together. And yeah, the garbage cans always have stuff in them. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. I wasn't expecting that much stuff. I'm going to leave the magazine. I'm not that into it. I wish I could take it, but I can't. So I'm not going to stress over it. The rest of the stuff I'm going to pop right out. There we go. And we're going to look in here. Ah, uh, yes. I know why I remembered this. Because I came in here and thought about looting. Oh, lots of stuff. Water storage station we've already got. Greenhouse we've already got sewing machine we're good with square sledgehammer i don't know if i have that steel crafting we've already got okay next oh that's so sick i'm taking that with me cowboy hat i've already got one let's take another one just in case you never know if something might happen to your hats okay right on the floor oopsie grab the camera go anything else 
Ooh, we almost missed this one. Ah. Where'd you go? All right, I'm going to drop it in here. We're going to go ahead and grab everything, throw it into the truck. And then we're going to head on to the next one. We are here. We've already got the one down here. There's one left and it's right here. So I'm going to hit this road. It might be train tracks. Don't quote me on the road thing. It's still a great mode of transportation, though. The train tracks. Let me just add as long as the train isn't there. If the train is there, don't try to go through it. Don't try to squeeze by because you're going to get stuck and then you're going to have to spawn in another car and then you're going to have to carry your bags from one car to the other and trade out all the tires and the engine and all the other stuff that comes inside. Not that I did it myself. I don't know that for sure. Let's go. Guess what we found? I drove along. This is a train track, by the way. This right here, the darker line next to it is an actual road. I don't know why the road isn't showing here. It's certainly there. I drove on it, but there's a gas station right there. And we're not in dire straits for gas, but we can definitely use it. The, the gas station is right here at the corner. Okay. So we're going to we're going to go we're going to go get some gas. Why did I say it like that? I don't know. Ow. Who's next? Oh, there you go. Like bugs on a windshield, man. I feel a little bit bad. I'm you know what? I'm going to get out. I'm going to I'm going to do this the old fashioned way with my knife. Uh, it was the wrong way. I was facing the wrong way. It's OK. Definitely. Woo. Definitely got to do her. Wait, let's not say that, my sir. We definitely got to kill her with our blade. There we go. Hey, Muriel. Oh, it's so nice seeing you again. All right. Come on, hard hat. Die. Man, can he take it? Look at him. He's soaking wet. Jeez. Basically, I had to just pulverize him. Okay, let's pick up all of our goodies. Our special pom-poms. And of course, we get garbage from the cheerleader. <laughs> of course. Why did I expect anything else? Joke's on her. Garbage is helpful, too. Especially now that we can use it for bandages. <gasps> Ow. Nope. I knew that was going to happen. Can I can I actually use one of these? Let's see. Uh, treats minor wounds and moderate wounds. It's not really a wound. That's a bad tummy. There we go. That's good. Don't worry. I won't let you suffer anymore. Okay. That's. 40 gallons. And what about you? Another 50. That's 90 gallons total. We've got a 150 gallon truck. I believe we've got about 40 gallons in there. Let's take a look. Uh, 55. So not quite full, but close. Let's back her up. I can impress you guys with my reversing skills. As long as when I get out, the car doesn't try to drive off. That's the worst. Why do they even make it happen? Boop. Boop. There we go. We just pick it up and drop it in. I could put it in a bag and take it home and stick it on a shelf, but 
why. Actually, you have some actual room here. There go. This will make it a lot easier. Drag and drop. 15, 25. There we go. Ooh, it's so close to full. Oh, that's satisfying. My truck is going to be so happy. All right, before we get back on the road, I'm going to take a really quick look. We need to... I think it's the train tracks. I think we need to go along the train tracks. We're going to go along this road, and then we'll turn left at the first turn over the train tracks take the next right okay uh turn this way let's go this factory that we're passing right here is also a really good place for gasoline and stuff like that oh no oh no 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 okay we did not want to hit him he does a lot of damage to our car and then the right, there we go. Let's see. Now, typically I would just, have I been here? I don't, I don't remember if I've been here or not. This looks like a really good place to loot. If I haven't been here, I'm gonna stop. I'll have to check back. Okay, let's try to find this place. This is definitely not it. Need some place with a little bit more defense. Okay, I'm going to stop up here and check the map. It is actually very difficult to drive with the motor like it is. I've got the speed up, speed up motor, I guess, in the truck. And once you start going, it is killer all right i think we need to turn here oh don't tip over okay there we go okay that's all fenced off so shit out of luck there ah there at the end okay we need to be on this track, that I think is it. Are these guys stupid? Oh. With all the ferocity of an actual deer. Good to know. Oh, this is not going to end well. Oh, it didn't end badly at all. It's very, very difficult to turn this car. Okay. Try it again. Uh, I got turned around. This is where I turned last time. Turn. There we go. We need to go back up here. Where are you guys? Do 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 do. Need to get some speed. Oh. Oh, -ho, the zombies are here. Shit. I wonder if the zombies will go after them too or if it's just us. If I come up here and the zombies are not like chewing on one of these legs, I'm going to be very disappointed. Ooh, ow! Shit! I'm going to need new armor for my car after this. Nope. I'm 
horrible at running people over. Okay, back, back, back. My poor keys. The keys to my computer, I'm really pounding them right now. All right, you know what? Fuck it. Asshole. All right. 83 out of 100. This is the last compound that we've got to do. I've got a good amount of ammo left. And I don't see any zombies gnawing on anybody. I am so disappointed. All right. Where are all these dudes that I ran over? I know it's probably pretty boring to watch, but try it out, you guys. It is, it's very satisfying hearing them just go bonk, bonk, bonk against the windshield. Seriously. <laughs> All right. Oh, shit. Oh, it's okay. It's just you. He scared me. I thought he was a, a bad guy, but he's just a zombie. All right. So. This looks like just a normal ass POI, which is cool. I'm I'm OK with that. Uh, let's take a look here. I'll take that. I'm leaving everything else in there. An engine in the stove. That's where I keep my engines. Uh, yeah, please. I really, really badly need some energy. My energy is negative five right now. Uh, canned dog food can stay there. Ooh, these are good. Booze, cigarettes. I'm leaving the magazines. Got like a whole box full of magazines. And I pretty much maxed out on all of my tech. So I'm not really worried about it. Fruit pulp. Sounds delicious. I'm actually a huge fruit fan. I love fruit. And the garbage. Oh, I'm too bad. Uh... What can I take out? <laughs> Let's drop this and I will pick it up with my hands. Make sure nobody's going to shoot us as we're running through here with our hands full of battery. Okay. All right. Let me grab this bag and throw some stuff in here. All right, we've got our bag filled up. We've got our backpack empty. Let's go check it out and see what we can get out of this place, including another person. I'm curious if it's going to be a girl or a boy. Going to have to have a gender reveal party. Burn half the forest down. It'll be fun. Let's see. Anybody want to murder me? Hello. What was that? Pick up. Oh, that's an herb. Okay. It looks different than when it's in my um my cultivation box, I think it's called. There she is. Let's get her. First things first. That way if anything happens and or I die. You know, I was curious, is it gonna be a boy? Is it gonna be a girl? It's a lesbian. There we go. All right. Hello. You look like you're handy. Thank you. She has such a cute voice. Look at the little toilet inside here. That's so funny. All right. Let's go ahead and start looting just a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean everything. Okay. Another refrigerator. I'm going to take it. I think I have another one at home already, but you can never be too sure. And I would rather have too many than not enough. So it's coming home with us. Uh, lots and lots of ointment, some invisa bandages, uh, backpack and pants. No, thank you. I don't need any of those. Let's go here next. Fridge. Ooh. 
fridge just like this is how I got this dysentery. This always has stuff in it. Barely anything, but I was kind of right. Okay, let's check in here. Keep your eye out for garbage cans. There we go. Get this container. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. That's amazing. That's a great find. Explosive arrows we're good with. Metal bows. I don't know why. I feel like I want to take it. Speed booster. We've got the Viking axe already. Advanced chem lab. Do I need that? I don't know. You know what? We're taking it anyway. Lots of stuff. Okay. We'll dismantle that. We'll take the battery. Oil extractors. Do I have an oil extractor already? I think I do. I think I do. All right, let's go ahead and dismantle all the stuff. I need to actually put the gun down. There we go. All right. There we go. We haven't had anybody interrupt us so far, so I'm going to go ahead and take off my bag. Worse comes to worse. Somebody does pop out with a gun. We've got probably about 80 bullets on us, so I feel comfortable in being able to murder them. Before I get shot to shit, uh, I can't say yes or no to that, but we'll figure it out when it happens. Run around and take a look at all the stuff around here. Let's see. Okay goodies here let's go ahead and just pick up the bag grab everything we can i don't think i'm gonna grab much at all Jeez. okay let's go ahead and dismantle these i kind of oops my thing broke let's go ahead and just drop another knife in there i kind of wish we could dismantle the pot i come across a lot of pots and it would be really nice if I could just break them down into iron or something. We can't, though, so we just go on with our lives. Uh, 67. Let's drop this here. I won't forget it. I promise. Tire. Off-road tires. Nice. Not anything I really want to take with me. Being really careful about little surprises. I wonder if I could blow those up. Oh, here we go. A little bit more stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and drop that. We'll leave the pot in there. My voice is getting all weird again. Already did that one. Okay, I think that's just about it. Let's go ahead and get out of here. And... Oh, there it is. Sometimes I forget where I put my truck. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> All right, we are back home. Take a look and see what we got going on here. All right, everybody's here. I wonder what their names are. Got that super deep voice, man. All right, let's take a look. All right, Barry. Barry, Mike, who's not bad looking, and Sasha. Sasha's such a pretty name. That's cool. We just need to get some guns for these three. We got all five of them now. Oh, holy moly. I gotta get some of the stuff out of here, because that is a lot of stuff. Next episode, we're going to go ahead and pick up with the saltpeter mines. I've been wanting to get the saltpeter mines set up for a while. I'm in very, very dire need of a good steady source of gunpowder. So we'll we'll take care of that next time. I'll show you guys exactly where that is. 
If you guys have any ideas of other games you want me to play or anything in particular you want me to take care of on this map, I think we're just about done exploring this place. Um, next episode, after we get done with the mine, I'll probably come up to this airport, which is, it's going to be fun. Don't miss it. But after that, we might be done on this map. I, I can't think of anything else that we really need to do. If you guys want me to show you where anything in particular is or just do anything else on this map, let me know down below. If you guys don't have anything else, I might either start No One Survived on Map 2, which is the larger map, or I might start a new series altogether. Just depends. I don't know. I don't know what we're doing. I literally live my life like this, you guys. This It's horrible. Um, I do want to take a second and say thank you to everybody who's taken the time to like, subscribe, or leave a comment on one of my videos. You guys are amazing, and I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you want to see more, go ahead and subscribe. I post videos every Thursday, Saturday, and Monday at 12 p.m. PST. I am West Coast, and members get early access. So if you're interested in seeing my videos a little bit earlier than everybody else, go ahead and subscribe. Memberships start at $4.99. And even if you can't or you don't want to, just watching till the end of the video means the world to me. Seriously, I can't tell you how much it means to me. Thank you to everybody again. And until next time, bye.